All right, this video is about how to beat unacceptable imitation. So when you get it, you're going to auto path to where it takes you to. And then we're going to head to the puzzle. You're going to climb up some rocks. I, I've done this a few times now to figure it out. So we'll give you a good uh, overview of how you do it. And just what the key is and how to do it. So you want to go all the way up there at the top, but it's up there. So you want to climb up over here at these rocks here. So you're going to come up here and up here and over on here. And then in this little space in between. And then up here and over here. and over across all right so what this puzzle is going to be is of a game of simon says basically where this is going to be number one this is number two and this is number three he's going to give do motions with his sword his shield his sword and shield he's either going to swing to the right He's going to use, if he swings his sword, he's going to swing like he's hitting this one. This is one. And if he swings his shield, it's going to be like he's going to hit this one. It's going to be number two. If he swings his shield and he hits the ground, it's going to be this one over here at number three. And he gives out eight, nine, ten, eleven, eleven motions, right? The first eight you need to write down because you're going to have to repeat those eight motions. And the last three will correspond to... You don't really have to worry about for the imitation game, but the last three are the key because he'll swing his sword first and then a little light will appear here indicating that's the corresponding action for the corresponding platform. And then he'll swing his shield for number two. This will light up and then he'll, he'll smash the shield down and this will light up indicating those motions corroborate to those platforms. The first eight you need to know, and then once he's starting, um, they start glowing, then you don't have to worry about it. So it's only eight that you really need to worry about. So let's start it up, and we'll, I'll show you what we're talking about. So as soon as you activate, you want to stand in between so you can watch him, and then you open up your general chat. So that's going to be a one. That's a three. That's another three because he's picked shield to the ground. Another three. That's three threes. Now there's another one, another one, and that's a two because he swung his shield but didn't hit the ground. That's a three. Okay, now this is the key. That's the one, two, because he swung the shield, and three would be on the ground, and there's three. So that's our, that's our key. So we're going to go one. This should light up. It lights up if you're doing it right. So we want to go three. That'll light up. We're going to wait for it to go away. Jump on it again. It'll light up. One more time. It'll light up. And now we're going back to one. It'll light up. Step off it. Wait for the thing to go away. And then back on it. And then two. And finally, three. And we're done. That's it. That's all there is to it. Now, talk to the little thingy, and you got the completed. That's it. Easy peasy.